I have a, I have a tweet that I want you to react to. This is, this is from you. Uh, women can't stand nice guys. They put you in the friend zone, but they won't even consider you a friend. <laughs> oh, that's going to make people mad. Uh, nice guys. So I was, uh, three weeks ago, I was having dinner with Dr. Robert Glover down in Arizona. I actually, He's he was my last guest. I had him on a, that's wonderful. I, yeah. I, I, I saw, I, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, he was fantastic. We had a great dinner together. So he's the author, as you know, and hopefully the audience at home knows he's the author of No More Mr. Nice Guy. And it is so true that women are women are confused by and disturbed by nice guys. And nice guys think that their behavior is carefully crafted to make them attractive to women. It makes you unpredictable. It helps them. It makes them think that you are driven by fear. It makes them wonder what your secret motives are. It makes them aware that you at some point are probably going to react with bitterness and resentment against them for not fulfilling their secret desires. And they treat you like a child. So they pat you on the head and then they back off and they put you right over there in a box where you're going to be safe because you can't be trusted being in this close and they will date some jerk who is at least a little more predictable and a little more assertive than you. And it's not that women want jerks. It's that jerks at least mimic closer to what a secure man will look like than a nice guy does. Something that me and uh, Dr. Robert talked about a little bit was this distinction between, so there, there's that term nice guy. And I feel like a lot of people hear that and they think that they can't be nice. And I think there's an important distinction to make that nice guy is a term that almost means like being needy or being like, overly too much and like you can be kind right you can be a nice person still that's it that's yeah. the difference a nice guy and a kind man are two very different things nice guys usually have anxious attachment style and they have an innate unsell uh, self unworthiness about them that they don't believe they deserve love so they can never tell the truth and ask for what they want they can't just be open and clear with you they have no confidence that's the problem with nice guys the niceness is their transactional model of getting their needs met without ever telling you what they're going to ask for you for later on it's like the mafia no don't worry about it. i'm gonna I'll do you i'll do you five favors but uh, you know, don't worry about it. Maybe, maybe three years from now, I'll come to you with a request, right? That's the nice guy system. Be kind for, for yeah, absolutely. Please be kind, but don't be nice. Hmm. And what you'll find is maybe if you reject the nice guy, he reacts in a certain way that you realize maybe he's not so nice. Um, I actually have a quote from you that makes me say this. Nice guys look really fluffy at first, but really vicious at the end when you reject them. And that's it. It's it's because they've they spent so much time doing 20 nice things for you, bending over backwards, giving you the shirt off their back that you didn't even ask for or didn't even want. And you, they do all these nice things for you. I had a client not too long ago who told me his he was raised by a nice guy father. And he said when he was a teenager, his dad bought him a car and his dad would wash his car every Saturday. And he said he he hated hated waking up to the sound of running water outside because it meant his father had decided to wash his car and then later his father would turn that into a mandatory demand that he pay him back by doing a favor that he had no right to refuse and if he tried to refuse he would his father would just unleash on him his anger for not having done what he wanted and said i washed your car for you and he would get into screaming matches with his father please stop washing my car i don't want to be in debt to you anymore that's the nice guy problem. 